Bye, Bunny TV. Ha ha ha. On YouTube. I have seen these a number of different places, and I couldn't quite understand them. I saw them online, and then I saw one in a Lego store, and I had to come home and try to build it. Because it looks like it is just defying gravity. This tensegrity sculpture. And there are some very complicated ones based on this principle. But I luckily I had the pieces I needed to be able to put this together. But you can see that there's just regular chains holding this up. They're not rigid. But what's happening is that middle chain is holding it up. The chains on the side are just preventing it from falling over. But it looks like it's defying gravity. And um, I'm just really glad I had the pieces to make it. It's not perfect, though, as you can see. And even just slightly moving, see how I slight that, that chain is slightly crooked on the top? it can make it uh, very unstable. And so when I put them on, I kind of had to move the studs on the top of the chains to get them to attach well. So this is going to go into my collection. It's, uh, I still haven't gotten tired of looking at it, and it just, uh, you know, maybe in the future I'll try some other designs, but I had fun building this little tensegrity sculpture. Hi, Bunny TV! Ha ha ha! On YouTube! Ha ha ha! He needs me to